Hey guys, um, this is Lauren at the library and today we are making pumpkin catapults. So, um, in your kit uh, you will find um, three pipe cleaners, they're all folded up, um, a uh, popsicle stick with the lid glued on, hot glued on. Uh, if you're doing this craft like after we do our kits or you're not picking up our kits, you can just find a lid and, and hot glue it onto a popsicle stick. Um, you will also need uh, seven more popsicle sticks, uh, some kind of a projectile, and we also give you guys a starburst as a candy projectile because it's Halloween. Um, and because we wanted to give you p candy pumpkins, um, but they're not individually wrapped. So um, if you guys want, you can go to the store and buy candy pumpkins, but we got what you got you a starburst. So your catapult is pretty simple. Um, first thing you're gonna wanna do is take your bottle cap and another one of your um, sticks and wrap your pipe cleaner all along the bottom edge, kind of like this guy here is. Nothing fancy, just wrap it pretty tightly. Like that. Okay. Then take your other popsicle sticks and stack them together. And you're gonna do the same thing on both ends. You're gonna take a pipe cleaner. Oh, we four pipe cleaners, not three, sorry. Um, you'll take a pipe cleaner and you'll wrap it and even there and all right wrap it on either end and then open up your first two with the lid be careful because the lid can come off <laughs> that's what happened with this one it's actually taped on um, so don't try not to like push against the lid as you're opening these up. Um, a second person could be helpful to help slide things in. Um, it's gonna be pretty tight as you slide it, so um, kind of keep hold of it. And while you have hold of it, you're going to want to take your final pipe cleaner and kind of wrap it around um, the two sets of popsicle sticks. And I'm just going to do diagonal one way and diagonal the other and keep repeating like that to keep it nice and tight. Um, you can also use a rubber band for this, uh, which could work better. It's just sometimes is a little trickier to wrap um, or to get actually on this part. So it does work better at holding things in place a little bit though. But it's up to you. This works great too. So now you have your catapult and in order to launch it, um, you can see it's kind of, it kind of moves up front, it moves once you've gotten it in place. And so um, you're going to want to push it and hold it as you load the catapult. Um, and when you press it down, you create, you want to hold this here and you create this potential energy which when you release it is what creates um, the projectile motion and lets your, your candy fly. So let's see how this works. Oh my god, <laughs> that was awesome. All right, let's do this one. Oh, it fits really well. Oh wow, that goes so far. So there you go, that is your Cat, um, pumpkin or candy catapult launcher. Thanks, and see you later.